This is Mike's brand new 2022 FX3 Carbon Cub with some very special wrap on it here. Mike, tell us a little bit about, this is brand new, tell us a little bit about yourself first. Yeah, so I'm a rookie pilot, uh, fresh five years in on this, and um, I've come from a world of design and marketing. And so when I decided to purchase an aircraft, I knew I wasn't just going to, you know, take delivery of something with a couple stripes on it and call it a day. So. Uh, you know, long back two and a half years ago, I started thinking about what this aircraft was going to be. And, um, you know, if you look back uh, on my past, I've always loved Alice in Wonderland and this whole world of, you know, kind of this whimsical storytelling. And when when I started thinking about what this airplane was going to be in chapter six of, of the original book, yeah, uh, Alice is wandering through Wonderland and she's kind of flustered and she's, you know, kind of lost her mind and whatnot. She bumps into the Cheshire Cat. She says, well, Cheshire Cat... I'm so glad to see you. Can you tell me which way I ought to go from here? And he says, well, that depends a great deal on where you're trying to get to. And she says, oh, I don't much, I don't care much where. And he says, well, then it doesn't much matter which way you go. Yeah. And that's kind of the fundamental basis of this plane, right? It's about just going, exploring the world's your wonderland, go to the next spot, doesn't matter which direction you're going. So, Cheshire Cat it was. And so, that's a vinyl wrap, but you've got this QR code on here. And right. I'll, I'll post a still picture on here, and if you take the... Uh, if you take your QR code reader, what does it do? Yeah, so if you scan the code, uh, it just walks you through a sequence of, uh, you know, letting the uh, phone, uh, letting your phone utilize the camera to bring up this augmented reality experience. So basically, you scan the code, cat comes to life. It's just a little bit of a who and ha uh, uh, experience around the plane. But uh, yeah, this thing's going to keep going deeper and deeper and deeper into this other side, I call it. Uh, this whole concept of advertising on an airplane, or basically you can use your airplane as a billboard, an interactive billboard. I mean, that cat really comes to life and starts moving around. Yeah, absolutely. And then it takes you to a website, and then you can follow along with the adventures of the whole airplane. Yeah, yeah. the idea was just sort of what more could, you, what more could we do with this thing versus just, you know, we already are doing this innovative wrap I've never seen anything that looks like this you know the guys that wrapped it are FAA certified there's you know a lot of thinking that just went into sticking this label on there um, and then after that I was you know I kept thinking well what the hell else could I do with this thing <laughs> and uh, the augmented reality just fits the theme it fits the wonderland it fits you know kind of this other side concept so Blanco Lirio needs one of these if I put if I put my logo on there with a the QR code boom send you right to the YouTube channel and it's just a Thin vinyl wrap. There's the edge of it right there, and the artwork. This is not your artwork. Look, there's Alice. There's a lot of little hidden details in here, but it's this fella here who did the artwork. Yeah, his name's Greg Simpkins. He goes by Crail, a Los Angeles-based uh, artist, really well known in sort of the old graffiti scene. He came from Torrance and you know spent a ton of time in Compton. He's just got an awesome backstory and history. And I actually got put in touch with him through Eric Bond, the guys at Spin Imaging, who uh, applied the uh the wrap and helped out with that whole process so he's been great and supported the whole thing he autographed the plane and we threw a little vinyl over it so it won't wash off and uh, yeah that's that's where we're at and then you had uh, and then the idea needs to catch on to things like imagine airliners with winglets and then passengers could take pictures of qr codes boom advertising right, that's right. there i mean just the concept behind this sort of augmented reality has got a lot of legs and you know like i was saying the winglets are perfect you got however many thousands of people in the air shooting a photo of a plane every day you know why not slap a qr code on there why not give back a brand experience or have somebody come to life and be hanging off the wing or whatever <laughs> it is and talk about why the winglets are important for flight you know or you know provide some brand experience back and give give kids adults whomever it is a, a way to engage with you know the airline that they're sitting on the same uh, thing over at the smithsonian or museums yeah, they could do a similar kind of a, had thing. a conversation with with a friend of mine who sits on the board and he, and he says you know he took a look at the plane and what i was doing with it he says this is this is awesome we got to implement something like this at the aerospace museum and they think about holding up your phone and having a vet or whomever it might be come out and talk about the aircraft or a personal story of what they've done it's incredible so it's you know, it's a, it's a technology that's not new and, and fresh off the plate, but there's new ways to implement it. Uh, it's not widely used here in aviation yet, but you're on the leading edge of it. That's right. That's right. All right. <laughs> Mike's Carbon Cub, November 665 Carbon Cub. Charlie Charlie, or Chesser Cat, <laughs> as the case may be. Beautiful build. All the latest in experimental avionics with a full-on autopilot electric trim this being the fx3 has the bigger engine with the constant speed prop 
These are the uh, Acme Acme suspension, Behringer wheels and brakes. The Hartzell Trailblazer propeller. Or, That's right. Yep. Yep. Trailblazer. Yeah. Yeah. What size wheels? Thirty-one. Thirty-one inch Alaska Bush wheels. Just a great build. All flat back, flat black paint job with the wrap. Got the suspension on the tail wheel as well. Pretty cool. Hit the, uh, I'll put the still picture up and try it out on your cell phone on your computer at home. See if you can pick up that QR code and bring that cat to life. See you here. Thanks, Mike. Thanks for bringing her by. You bet.